सो हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल विंडोज टिप्स एंड ट्रिक्स वन अगेन सो आई एम बैक विद अ वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग वीडियो फॉर यूल इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू दैट हाउ यू कैन टेक अ स्क्रोलिंग स्क्रीन शॉट ऑफ एनी वेबसाइट विद द हेल्प ऑफ माइक्रोसॉफ्ट एज ब्राउजर इन माइक्रोसॉफ्ट एज ब्राउजर यू आर गेटिंग अ फैसिलिटी अ फीचर दैट इज कल्ड वेब कैप्चर सो विद दैट विद दैट फीचर यू कैन एक्चुअली टेक द स्क्रोलिंग स्क्रीन शॉट यू कैन ड्रैग द क्लिक फ्रॉम द माउस एंड यू कैन स्क्रोल इट एंड यू कैन टेक स्क्रीन शॉट ऑफ एनी बाई स्क्रोलिंग so i am going to explain that feature only and how i'm i'm also going to show you the demo how you can take a screenshot so make sure to watch this video till the end and this this feature will also work in your daily work and this can help in your daily work so this will work in microsoft edge browser so make sure microsoft edge browser you have microsoft edge browser in your windows laptop or computer this comes pre installed so no need to no need to worry for that now just uh, let us without any further ado let us go through the video now let's let's open edge browser so here's my edge browser so as you well can see i have opened my edge browser now just go to that website of which you want to take um, the scrolling screen so for example i want to take uh, this article scrolling screenshot so what i'll do i'll just uh, at the right top corner you will get uh, the three dots of edge browser so make sure to click here and you will get your option that is web capture and yes if you are not getting this option then just uh, click on this three dots then this might be your browser is not up to date so just go to settings go to about microsoft edge and make sure your browser is up to date if it's not updated then it will show updating microsoft edge so it will update now just close the browser and restart your browser then you'll able to, now just go to this three dots you'll be able to get this option that is web capture click on this option now as you all can see we have got two options that is capture area or capture web page you can directly use the capture full page feature for if you want to take the full page screenshot so we are we will be using capture area so as you all can see our mouse got changed in a uh, plus sign so we will just drag from the corner so that as you all can see our page is getting scrolled now our page is scrolling now just uh, select that area of what you want to take screenshot i want to take screenshot till here you can also drag till the bottom also so just click on here now you, you can see a few options that is couple co sorry copy and uh, markup capture so just click on markup capture you can directly copy it to your clipboard now as you can just edit here now as now as you can see that uh, that uh, here is our screenshot here is our scrolling screenshot and you might be wondering that how you can save this in our computer so just click on the save button now you, you will get a prompt what do you want to do with web capture you can also save it in your computer but i'll not save it now i'll just show you by opening it you can directly now as well can see scrolling screenshot is been done and also don't think that it's taking the bad quality picture it's taking the good quality picture also you can send it to any and you don't need to take two three screenshots and send it one by one you can just take a long screenshot like this and you can send it to anyone and you can use it in your daily work so that's it you can just see this is screenshot and you can take screenshots more from edge browser and this is a very good feature i like this feature and also i'm telling you guys as you can see here is my button web capture and, and you also might be thinking that how you can get this button to our edge browser toolbar so i'm i'm also going to tell you that also so just click on this three dots click on settings click on this go to this tab that is appearance scroll down and you'll get your option that is select which buttons to show on the toolbar um scroll down you will get your option that is web capture button if this is off then just turn it on now open a new tab page you will get a web capture button here so that's it was the today video hope you hope the video was useful for you and hope you like the video and please if you if the video was really helpful for you please give this video a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel to get the latest updates about my videos as you are as you all are getting and also keep supporting guys um, and i'll meet you at the next video So till then bye bye take care